Hey guys, so just have a quick update from uh, Livingston, downtown Livingston in Zambia. Uh, so I just uh, received an email or re received a phone call from my friend saying the uh, final customs release has been uh, emailed to me. They eventually signed it. So I'm free to leave. Uh, but I said it's 3.30 here now. It's an hour's, dri hour's drive to the border. Uh, on a good day, let's say an hour to get through and then trying to find a place to sleep that side. It's just too much mission. So plans have been amended. Uh, I'm going to be spending the night here and leaving at about, I don't know, I guess six, seven o'clock tomorrow morning and straight on into Bobanong. Uh, all border crossing so far have been uh, a nightmare. Bloody trucks. You know, bane of my existence this whole trip. Uh, yeah, so. Uh, uh, so far, every border crossing has been a nightmare. Uh, crossing from South Africa. I don't know what this is behind me. It's all abandoned, but I, I looked in there earlier. But uh, border crossing from South Africa into Botswana was fine. Just it's a, a single bridge, so you have to wait for traffic going in the opposite direction to come through, and then this side goes through. Trip into uh, Zambia. And that's one where I got stuck for three days because I didn't have the right paperwork for the for the for the truck. Uh, Zambia into Malawi. That was even worse because uh, when I left, came into Zambia, got stamped in, uh, couldn't get in, got stamped out, and then came back with the correct paperwork, and uh, they didn't stamp me back in again. So without even knowing it, I was in the country illegally. Managed to get that sorted out uh, from. Uh, Malawi back to Zambia was another nightmare because I didn't have the original uh, car papers. I, I didn't have them, hadn't been stamped, and uh, just just a pain in the pain in the backside all the way through. Uh, but yeah, so plans have been amended. Hopefully, it's a quick border crossing tomorrow, and then uh, straight on into Bobonong to hopefully get those Botswana agates. That is a bit of a weird story. Um, uh, I went to a place called Celebi Pikwe where I'd heard there was a guy doing the Botswana agates some time ago, but uh, nobody has heard of him. Into Zambia, some random guy knows somebody uh, who does the Botswana agates and uh, gave me the phone number in Bobanong, so the guy's expecting me. So hopefully I'll get those. Trucks, I hate them. Uh, but yeah, so I'll be leaving here tomorrow morning early. Hopefully I'll get the Botswana agates then back on into South Africa and then get the uh, amethyst and everything up on the website for sale. If you're watching me for the first time on YouTube, uh, good idea to subscribe and ring the bell so you can see the, the live sales we're doing. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching guys and the new all the good new stuff, about two tons uh, that will be available for sale as soon as I get back home and cleaned up and put on the website. See ya!